My name is Mrs. Young. I like to make videos to teach you new things and to help you remember the things you already know. I'm glad you're here today. Hi guys, how's everybody doing today? I hope you are all doing great. Today is dun, 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 Tuesday, September 19th in the year 2023. And if we look at our calendar, we are on the 19th of September in the year 2023. We are on the third full week of the month, and we only have one more week to go, and September will be finished. It's going by so fast already. Uh, we, <clears throat> we don't have any other major holidays coming up, but the first day of autumn, like I mentioned, is coming up this Saturday. The weather in a lot of places is starting to change. Some places not yet, but some places it is starting to get a little cooler and the leaves are starting to change. And if you're a football fan like I am, uh, <clears throat> it's okay if you don't like football, though, because everybody likes different things. But if you are, football season has started, which has been fun. College football plays on Saturday, and professional football plays on Sundays. And baseball season is winding down, and we will have a lesson about that coming up. Today, our lesson is going to be about Hispanic Heritage Month, and that is starting September 15th. Okay, guys, so let's learn all about it. Are you ready? Hispanic Heritage Month is a time to celebrate the history, culture, and contributions of Hispanic and Latino Americans in the United States. It takes place from September 15th to October 15th each year. Hispanic Heritage started as a week-long observance in 1968, but in 1988, President Ronald Reagan made it a month-long celebration. The month of September was chosen because it includes the Independence Days of several Latin American countries, including Costa Rica, El Salvador, Guatemala, Honduras, and Nicaragua. The term Hispanic means people with a Spanish-speaking heritage, and the term Latino means people from Latin America. Hispanic Heritage Month honors the contributions of people from Mexico, Central America, South America, and the Caribbean. Hispanic people have made many contributions to American culture, including in the arts and sciences, sports, and business. Here are some famous Hispanic people you may recognize. Her Geraldo Rivera is a famous journalist. Cameron Diaz. America Ferreira and Jennifer Lopez are famous Hispanic and Latino American actors. Selena Gomez and Carol G are some famous singers. Alex Rodriguez and Lori Hernandez are famous athletes. There are many ways to celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month. You can learn about Hispanic culture by reading books, watching videos or movies about Latin American countries, and listening to some Latin music. You can try to cook some Hispanic foods or learn some Spanish words. There are also many festivals and events held during Hispanic Heritage Month that you can attend. Each year there is a theme for Hispanic Heritage Month and this year it is Todos Somos Somos Uno, which means we are all, we are one, to highlight the diversity within the Hispanic community and the power of unity. Okay guys, so I hope you learned all about Hispanic Heritage Month. And remember, if there's anything that particularly interests you about Hispanic Heritage Month or something that you want to learn more about, you can always look it up on the internet. There's lots of information out there. Also, I wanted to mention before we go that there are two other observe, well, there are several other observances for the month of September, but I wanted to point out two of them. September is also Better Breakfast Month. So, in some people's opinion, they think that 
breakfast is the most important meal of the day because when we're sleeping, we're not eating anything. And so when we get up in the morning, our body needs some nourishment and not the nourishment that comes from a donut because that is not very healthy. Um, a better breakfast means maybe a piece of fruit or some orange juice or a nice piece of toast and an egg. So something a little bit more healthy to start your day. That is one of the other observances. And the other one for the month of September that I wanted to point out today is Classical Music Month. And that is a time to study and appreciate classical music. Classical music is the kind of music that is played with instruments like the flute and the piano and the violin and the bass and the clarinet. And you might hear classical music being played in an orchestra. And you might have heard about some famous composers or Famous people who wrote the classical music, like Beethoven and Bach and Mozart. So September is a time to study and appreciate classical music. Okay, guys. Well, I hope you have a great day. I hope you have a wonderful week. And I will see you next Tuesday in our next video. Bye.